Hey there, fellow viewers and content creators. Today, we're diving into the ultimate showdown between TikTok and YouTube algorithms. Picture this, two weeks ago, I dropped a video bomb on TikTok, and guess what? I unleashed the same beast on YouTube. But here's the kicker, the difference in views and engagement. Mind-blowing. In this video, we're going to dissect these two platforms from an algorithmic perspective. And you might be thinking, oh, it's probably because I've got over 30,000 TikTok followers. Well, hold that thought. I've dropped the link to our case video in the comments below. And hey, if you're new here, consider hitting that subscribe button, it helps me more than you know. So here is what the numbers are looking like. The same video got under 77 views on YouTube shorts and zero comments with 3 likes only. Now let's look at the same video on TikTok, it got over 21,000 views with close to a 1,000 likes and over 600 comments. No time to waste, folks. Let's jump right into these platform showdowns. TikTok Algorithm 1. For You Page TikTok's main algorithm is designed to curate the For You page, which is the default feed for users. It shows a personalized selection of videos based on user interaction, such as likes, comments, shares, and watch time. It also considers the content you engage with in your browsing history. 2. Content Discovery TikTok's algorithm actively promotes new and diverse content to keep users engaged. It doesn't heavily rely on followers, even new creators have a chance to go viral if their content resonates with the audience. 3. Video Length TikTok prefers shorter videos that are visually engaging, with quick hooks to capture viewers' attention in the first few seconds. YouTube Algorithm 1. Recommendation System YouTube's algorithm focuses on recommending videos to users based on their watch history, search history, and engagement. It aims to keep users on the platform for longer by suggesting content they are likely to enjoy. 2. Watch Time YouTube prioritizes watch time as a key metric. Videos that keep viewers watching for longer durations are more likely to be recommended to a broader audience. 3. Keyword and Metadata YouTube also uses video titles, descriptions, tags, and closed captions to understand the content. Optimizing these elements can improve a video's discoverability. 4. Subscriber Influence While not as critical as it once was, having a subscriber base can still help your videos get initial traction. Subscribers are more likely to see your new uploads. 5. Engagement Metrics Metrics like click-through rate and average view duration are crucial. A high CTR indicates your thumbnail and title are effective, while a longer average view duration signals engaging content. 6. Upload Schedule Consistency in uploading can also positively affect how YouTube promotes your content. So, it is easy now to see why most people enjoy TikTok over YouTube and with the platform having introduced a 10-minute video and a landscape option. I would say that YouTube is in big trouble and they could find themselves losing a lot of viewers to TikTok if they don't work on fixing their algorithm. But in the same breath YouTube has proper quality content that one can specifically search for unlike TikTok that relies on your mood for the day. But also, I am not happy because it doesn't matter how good or controversial my content is. There are no random trends in YouTube, one has to grow gradually and the tools and knowledge needed feels like one is back in university. Oh, by the way I decided to keep my video short just in case you have TikTok attention shot span. And before you go, don't forget to smash that like button if this video was as informative as your favorite teacher's class and leave a comment even if it is to tell me that my content sucked donkey balls. Ha ha ha. Catch you in the next one.